Hello, I'm Trevor Green, the proud superintendent of the Yakima School District, and today with me we have Byron Gerard. He is our Executive Director of College and Career Readiness. Welcome, Byron. Thank you. He comes to us from Bellingham. This is his first year in the district. What is something that you'd like us to know about yourself, Byron? Oh, I've been a high school administrator for about 20 years and just love the opportunity to come to Yakima and use all of those high school readiness skills as a high school principal to then transfer that into helping students and schools become more career and college ready. Byron, you've made a tremendous positive impact already in your time here in the Yakima School District. And we're here today to talk about one of those great opportunities for our families and their, and their students. Uh, and it has to do with a guaranteed admission to universities. Uh, so this is a tremendous, incredible opportunity for students to go right from high school into college and not worry so much about the application process. There still is a process, but I'd love for you to detail for us. Tell us about this uh, admission process. Tell us about which universities are involved and uh, what I, you know, I have a senior of my own, what it would take for her to then enter into one of these universities. Sure. Well, it's a great opportunity and it's been a privilege to work on this opportunity, but state leaders got together and really challenged local universities to come together and come up with a more streamlined, um, fair and equitable admissions process for students. And so they came up with the guaranteed college admissions program. It's a pilot program this year. About 60 school districts around our state are participating. We're one of them. And the colleges that are participating are Western Washington University, Central Washington, Eastern Washington, Evergreen State College, PLU, and WSU. And WSU. Oh, yeah. I can't yeah. forget that over yeah. here. Yeah. And so um, as a college parent myself, I have two kids in, in college, and the process to navigate college admissions is really is really a hard one. And even as an educator parent, it was hard for me. And it is so much more hard for families to navigate that process, for students to know where to begin the conversation, to, for parents to know how to begin that conversation or that process. What this program is doing is, is if a student has met the minimum GPA requirement for that university, then essentially they're in. They still need to go through the application process. They need to file an application, wow. fill out their FAFSA. But as far as those other things like a like a, um, an SAT or ACT score met or an essay being written, all those things have been set aside and the student will be reached out to directly by the universities. So the students won't even have to go search them out. They'll receive an acceptance letter their senior wow. year saying, yeah. you know, Trevor Green, you have met our admissions qualifications and welcome to our university. So an example then, my, my daughter, who again is a senior, she could expect with a qualifying GPA to then receive an acceptance letter from Western uh, Washington University, Eastern Washington University, Central Washington University, Pacific Lutheran University, Evergreen State, State College, College yep. and Washington State University yeah. as options. So she will have six options uh, knowing that she's already accepted and just needs to basically yeah. say yes and meet some other maybe minimal requirements yeah. as far as turning some information in and she's ready to go. How exciting for a Yakima senior to, re yeah. to receive six college yeah. admissions letter their senior year. Well, thank you. And again, tremendous work thus far. Um, you're making a, a great difference in our in our schools uh, for our students. I know that there are some other things in the works as well. I look forward to having you back here where we can learn more about the options that uh, are there for our students and for our families. Thank you. Thank you.